from a car owner with better health insurance than car insurance. Superhuman reflexes at a gas station. Today, we have a collection of clips that showcase exactly what happens when you have stupid themes, road rage, and mayhem all in one place. So buckle up, it's bound to be a bumpy ride on the wild side. After colliding with an oncoming car, an unsuspecting couple get out to exchange insurance details, but are met with a group of carjackers. What the f is going on? What is going on? Oh my god! Yes. 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 This driver cut off the black car, resulting in them having to stay in their own lane and not merge. So they try to strike back by attempting to carjack the car with nowhere to go. Bye, have a great time. After these two bikers try to smash his side window, this driver takes matters into his own hands. <laughs> After getting caught in the act, this side mirror stealing idiot needs to go home and take a long, hard look at himself in the. Well, you get the idea. Nyoink! I know they say finders keepers, but I'm not sure if you find it locked away in the trunk of a car, you can just smash it open and take it. Didn't stop these guys though. Nyoink. This sticky fingered car thief is caught red handed by the calmest person ever? How are you? This is my car. And I am calling the police. These scumbags try to distract this hard working older man while they try to steal his car. But when they can't figure out how to work it, I guess the pizza will have to do. Two pet pizzas. Yoink. This guy is a certified forklift truck driver, don't forget, and now a certified genius as he uses his forklift to stop a car thief in their tracks before they can get away with the goods. Just stop there. Yeah, you good. Now this next clip really is daylight robbery, as this not so bright car thief is caught on camera for the world to see, smashing a window and stealing goods in the middle of the day. What was that?
that saying? Scissors beats paper, paper beats rock, and rock beats idiots. I think chapter one in the How to Steal for Dummies guidebook is make sure the person you're stealing from is not around. I guess this thief lost his library card. Ah, it seems the art of disguise isn't dead. I mean, can you see this next wannabe car thief? I think he's done a good job at being well hidden. Hello there. I know they say in a world full of sheep, be a wolf, but driving the wrong way into oncoming traffic isn't the safest way to stand out from the crowd. Illegally overtaking a cyclist on double yellow lines, and then nearly crashing into oncoming traffic. All of this to arrive 0.3 milliseconds earlier. Is it really that worth it? This driver nearly causes a horrific crash when driving at over 120 miles per hour and cutting off a driver exiting a lane and narrowly missing them. What the some quick-witted reflexes save this next driver from a nasty crash. It'll only be new pants he'll need instead of a whole new car. Huh? Isn't it great when a driver races around a corner without flashing a turn signal and heads right for you? No, I didn't think so. Instead of taking your medicine and realizing that you're in the wrong lane, this driver decides to nearly total his own car and someone else's by performing a left turn from a center lane in front of another car. <laughs> 